With the bang of the gavel, the 2013 legislative session had begun. The first act of business, the oath of office. At the start of the 97th General Assembly, Republicans hold a 109 to 52 majority over the Democrats. After taking the oath of office, lawmakers unanimously elected Tim Jones to serve as Speaker of the Missouri House. The Speaker plans to focus his energy on three main topics during the 2013 legislative session. This is going to be a, a, a bipartisan agenda that I believe Missourians will embrace of economic development for job creation, of looking for a strong energy policy for a more energy independent Missouri, uh, and education, protecting the funding as the House has, has definitely done, K through 12 and higher ed. The Republicans hold a veto proof majority in both the House and Senate. Despite an historic majority, House Democrats claim they still have an important role to play in the legislative process. We will have to be the vocal uh, opposition, but we don't want to just be the blanket thorn in the side. We want to be able to work towards a better Missouri. We want to put people back to work, but we want to do it responsibly. The topic of Medicaid expansion has been a hot button issue since the governor announced his support behind expanding the state's Medicaid rules. House Democrats support the call and believe it will save the state in the long run. I think putting 220,000 more Missourians, giving them access to health care is the right thing to do. And we're talking about the federal government covering 100% of these costs. We're going to save the state $250 million over three years, and that's a conservative estimate. No, we are likely not very interested in expanding eligibility. Uh, we would be interested in, in seeing if we can obtain additional funding for those who truly need it, the ones who Republicans have always supported, the elderly, children, and the disabled. Lawmakers now turn their attention to the governor's annual State of the State address, where he will deliver his proposed budget for the upcoming fiscal year and lay out his 2013 legislative agenda. Reporting from the state capitol, I'm Jonathan Lorenz.